Hey guys and welcome to your next Objective C tutorial. In this tutorial I'm just gonna explain what an if decision statement is and what you can do with it. I'll just start typing one in. Let's give int x a value of 10 and then type in if and then it's gonna ask for a condition that um, we need to satisfy in order for the if statement to follow through. So we'll say if x is greater than 9 it will do something. Let's make it print out something saying x is greater than 9. And so now, whoops, as long as this x is greater than 9 is true, this will print out. So we could see that right here. There we go. x is greater than 9 because x equals 10. But if we put x equals 8, then nothing happens. There's no output. So let's let's try something a little different. Let's say x equals 100, and if x is greater than 200, it will print out x is greater than 200. Else, an s log, x is less than 200. And this else right here is just basically saying if it doesn't satisfy this condition then do this instead. So that's that's where you can decide between doing two things and see x is 100 and it says x is less than 200. You could also do something called an else if and so you could say else if and then we have to put in another condition let's say x is less than 100 you could say x is less than 100 and then you have to end it with an else and we'll say else and this log x is in between 100 and 200 so it goes through all these and it finds that x is not greater than 200 but it's also not less than 100 because it is 100 so it prints out the final else x is in between 100 and 200. And so that's just a little bit that you can do with if statements, else ifs, and all this. Thanks for watching.